The city of Gadsden is proposing to build an animal rendering facility at the airport property. Many in our community strongly oppose this move. From Gadsden to Etowah County to Rainbow City to Southside, such a project would have a huge impact on our quality of life, environment, airport, children, the list just goes on and on. My name is Christy Knowles. I'm an owner of Knowles & Sullivan, and I oppose this project. We're over a 100-year-old real estate auction company. We've been located in Gadsden for over 80 years. My name is Christy King Ray with J.P. King Auction Company, and I strongly oppose this project. I'm a parent and homeowner in close proximity to the proposed location. I am Jana Richardson, and I oppose this project. My name is Andy Hart. And with multiple businesses in the Gadsden area that depend on our thriving tourism, I oppose the chicken rendering plant. I represent 579 children who love to play outside. Our outside is within two miles of this proposed project. I'm Cindy Greer from Westbrook Christian School and I oppose this project. I'm Butch Stouthat, orthopedic surgeon, Northeast Orthopedics, and I'm opposed to this project. My name is Taylor Wiggins. I'm a financial advisor with Northwestern Mutual, and I oppose this project. I represent 275 associates who work directly across the street from the proposed facility. This will cause a very detrimental working environment for all our team members. I am Julie Chadwick, representing Choice Fabricators, and I oppose this project. I have been a business owner in Etowah County for around 28 years. I'm Trent Thrasher with Trent Thrasher Construction, and I strongly oppose this. We own property. 85 acres, about a mile from where they're wanting to put this plant. My name's Cindy Pruitt King. My family owns Pruitt's Barbecue. My husband owns J.P. King Auction Company, and we oppose this project. Pollution is never the solution in exchange for jobs for Etowah County. I'm Lee Wilson with Northeast Orthopedics, and I vehemently oppose this rendering. I personally am here fighting for my family-owned business and all of our customers and the ladies on our teams that all will be affected by this. I'm Kim Kidd, owner of the Willow Tree, and I most definitely oppose this rendering plan. With 579 children and 131 that we're personally responsible for, 1.42 miles away from the proposed rendering plant. I'm Brody Kroll, chairman of the board at Westbrook Christian School and executive director at Big Oak Ranch, and I categorically oppose the rendering plan. We are nearing the completion of a new church facility that is less than two miles away from this proposed site. It's going to have an effect on our church. It's going to have an effect on the students that do things outside. It's going to have an effect on the people's lives that live around this area. My name is Kyle Kentrell, and I oppose this project. My name is Andrew Ford. I'm the CEO of ZLA Solutions, and I oppose this project. I'm Jenny Thrasher, business owner in Gadsden and Rainbow City, and I strongly oppose the rendering project. My name is Blake New. I own Gadsden Variety, and I oppose this project. A study showed our river and lake system is worth $570 million in annual economic impact. Can we really afford to risk that to water pollution and air pollution? Our 33 employees cannot. I'm Tony Lumpkin, Bucks Island Marina, and I oppose this project. Hi, I'm Carolyn Parker. I'm a local business owner and local realtor, and I oppose the rendering plan in Etowah County. I'm Darrell Thomas and I oppose this project of the rendering plant being built at the airport. I'm a landowner 200 yards away from the proposed site of this rendering facility. My name is Lance Williamson and I am opposed to this plant. Hello, my name is Katrina Flambeau. I am a business owner of a salon here in Gadsden and I do reject the rendering spot because it is toxic, it is not healthy for our community and we need to keep Gadsden, Etowah County safe. I'm Harold Weaver owner of Stamp Products Incorporated, as well as a landowner within a mile and a half of the facility, and I oppose this plan. I'm Tanya Clark, the principal at John Jones Elementary School. And I'm Amanda Martinez, the assistant principal at John Jones Elementary School. On behalf of our 761 students, we would like to say, we, we oppose this, this project. project. According to the FAA, between the years of 1990 and 2013, there were over 137,000 bird strikes into aircraft. 90% of those occurred at local airports uh, during the critical phase of flight, such as takeoff or landing. 60% of those happened below 98 feet. I'm Dustin Watkins, I'm a pilot, and I oppose this project. If you want more information on how you can join us in this fight, please visit our website advanceetowah.com. 
There are resources there to link you to our Facebook page to gather more information and to make your voice heard.